You need a good pair of skates, a helmet, protective pads, as well as speed, strength and skill to be really good at roller derby. It's a really fast sport, so everyone needs to know exactly what they're doing. There are five people on each team divided up into different roles. We're the pivots, we're at the front of the pack, we set the pace and we're the last line of defence and you can tell what we are by the stripes on our helmets. Then you have the blockers, which are most of the team. Our job is to stop the opposition jammer from skating through and help our own jammer whiz through the pack. There's one jammer on each team, they're a bit like the strikers, and our job is to pass the opposing blockers to score points. And it's obvious who we are because we've got stars on our helmets. Each game is called a jam, and it starts when the referee blows their whistle and the blockers and pivots set off. Then on the second whistle, the jammers start to make their way through. The jammers only start scoring once they start passing the pack for the second time, and that's when the other players try to stop them. One of the most important things of the game is to be able to block well. You can do this in three legal ways. The first way is shoulder checking. The second way is hip check. And the last way is positional blocking. we can reach speeds of up to 13 miles an hour. The most important thing is to make sure your jam is ahead so then they can decide when to stop the jam just by putting their hands on their hips. That's when all the points get added up.